the Busakwe family had high hopes for their sons, Anele and Wonge. It was looking forward to them coming back as men. Now it has to prepare for a funeral. Hey, we are very devastated, devastated as a family. As a result, we don't know what to do and what is going to happen tomorrow. What has happened over it was not expected, although things happen. But this one is a, is, is, is a disaster. It's a disaster. We don't know what are we going to do. Where are we going to start? How are we going to bury them? The incident has even left fellow initiates traumatized. Other people are not, are not certain about what, what is going to happen. They, they feel, uh, they, they, their kids don't feel safe. Some of them have just decided that their, their kids should be taken from the bomber back home and wait for that celebration day. Traditional leaders have expressed shock over the incident. Now that this thing uh, happened, I think we must work in hand in hand with uh, SAPS uh, in order to make arrangements to rescue those initiates that are feeling uh, not safe, just to avoid anything that happens. We may never know anything from now. So you need to be careful or to be cautious just to prevent any, any damage that can happen. According to the Eastern Cape Health Department, eight initiates have died since the start of the summer initiation season. Abongile Yankees, SABC News, Ngamakwe.